One of the all-time greats has seen and done everything there is to do in this business. The following contest is a no-holds-barred match. Making his way to the ring, representing R.K. Bro from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 250 pounds, the Viper, Randy Orton. The definition of a WWE superstar, and in my opinion, there is no one as gifted in this game as Orton. Now, Corey, I agree. Legendary factions, all-time tag teams, but Randy Orton is best when he does some solo work. And when he's doing said solo work, Randy Orton is one of the most sadistic individuals the WWE has ever known. The more hostile the environment, the more at home Randy Orton seems to be. Randy Orton has made a career out of psychologically dissecting his opponents. And many of the victims who have fallen for the Viper schemes stay down for good. Always composed, always in control. No one is more calculated. Once legend killer, now possibly the greatest legend in WWE history. Get ready for the boom. Talks as well with his fists as he does at the announce table. And his opponent from Preston, England, weighing in at 246 pounds, Wade Barrett. Strength, arrogance, and cunning all in equal measure. And his time at the announce desk has just made him an even smarter competitor. He's not just calling the action. He's taking notes. Wade's confidence is at a real high because he knows he's still got it. Has proven himself as a championship caliber player in WWE and not to be taken lightly. No holds barred, no countouts, no disqualifications, no rope breaks. The squared circle may not contain these two, but they do ultimately have to finish it all in there. Everything is legal in this match, which means we're probably about to see some things that would actually be considered quite illegal out in the real world. In the corner! to their opponent. Oh, this isn't going to be good. Oh, man. And this one might be headed ringside. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Enough already. The Apex Predator taking command. Yeah, Barrett's got to assert himself back in this one. Ooh, shot. Oh. Stop gloating and put your attention back to the match. Well placed, kick to the gut. Another damaging kick. Nice combo. Toss back into the ring. sends a very clear message. Getting carried around, bad spot to be in. Oh, God, face first. And 
Some say the only limit in an ODQ is your own imagination. Right, so Saxon wouldn't stand a chance. For everyone else, though, the sky is the limit. Anything you wish you could do to get a win, you can probably arrange it here. So my advice is to hold nothing back. Has the opposition in the palm of his hand. Okay, he is not going to let him make a mockery of things. He's absorbing some tough hits now. Yeah, the longer this fight goes on, the more Orton's not going to make it easy on him. He'll head to the ring. Probably not going to win for a couple hundred years, Byron. You know why? Because the Billy Goat's curse is in effect. Oh, I can't stand this move. Hi, Colt. Oh, body is not meant to... Way to put the curse. Incredible, absolutely incredible. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Uh oh. A oh, timely counter by Barrett. Hits him with the counter. Watch the quickness on this. Suplex. Fishing for something beneath the ring. He's got one thing on his mind with that chair, and it has nothing to do with lounging. Right to the face. Whoa, not quite yet. At least they can say they won the match. I don't know if I'd say the battle scars were worth it, Cole, but I will say the one who did it to them isn't the one celebrating right now.